Hello, I'm Bart Brooks and welcome to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to be discussing the uh, video plans I have for 2024. Hope you've been having a well, happy new year. Things are going well. You're meeting your New Year's resolution. I'm trying to do mine as well. So, <laughs> Well, anyway, here's what I have planned in mind this year. I'm doing a, of course, a, doing an area event here in Clovis, uh, New Mexico. We have parades. We will have the uh, annual Pioneer Days Rodeo Parade. We also have the uh, Veterans Day Parade in November. Besides that, uh, Pioneer Days Parade, that's in early June. And then the annual uh, Christmas Parade, early December. And of course, I'll be there doing videos and posting them. You can also check my channel and see what uh, the, the parades in previous years I've done. We also have the Home and Garden Show, which uh, area vendors and businesses will display their merchandise and uh, services. And also this year, my uh, high school uh, class will have its uh, 50th uh, reunion. So all for the class of 1974, 50 years ago. And so it's been a while, we've gotten older and we're gonna show it in that video. And, You'll be seeing that in my video when I'm showing my classmates and what fun we have. Next will be an astronomy video. I'm a member of the local astronomy club, the Clovis New Mexico Astronomy Club. And every uh, summer we'll do uh, uh, viewing activities, uh, star parties at uh, two uh, out of town parks north of Clovis and south of Clovis where we'll set telescopes and anyone can, anyone can show up and uh, get a view of the telescope. What we're viewing, the moon, you know, Jupiter, Saturn, you know, nebula, star clusters, wherever it's available to see, we'll be uh, doing that. And that, that takes place from around May to uh, September. And beginning of that, uh, in April, will be a spectacular event. The, uh, on April 8th, will be a, a total solar eclipse, which will, uh, here showing this video, in this one picture here on the screen, where the, that's where the moon completely blocks the sun. And all you can see is the sun's corona surrounding the sun. It's a very spectacular event. Uh, we of us went up to uh, Casper, Wyoming back in 2017 to see the total eclipse that took place there. And it was well, well worthwhile the trip. And so hopefully we'll be uh, making a trip to uh, East Texas to see this. Yes, now here's, here's a map of the uh, path of totality. As you can see it crosses from Northern Mexico into East Central Texas, going to Arkansas, further northeast into the uh, <clears throat> New England area before it finishes the United States. So that, that's going to cover a great uh, deal of the United States, very populated areas, and it'll be a very wide uh, path of totality. So, so I hope for that, if, I do, if we do go, I will be doing a video of that. And, and of course, and our, again, going back to our star parties, we also have uh, viewing activities of the... Uh, local library where we'll maybe view the sun, the moon. Usually these events can attract more people because we hold it look, you know, here in Clovis at the library instead of having to hold it the out of town parks and people have to drive out to these parks to see these uh, uh, events. So. so in the meantime I'll also do uh, uh, photo slideshow videos of the of last year's uh, star parties. I'll be doing that very shortly. That's also part of my video plans for this year. So. And I also do music playing. That's the main theme on my channel. As you can see, Marburg's music and more. So uh, I, do, I do a lot of uh, free hand playing. Of course, Valentine's Day will be soon be showing. So this, roses are red, violets are blue. And, uh, and I'll be uh, demonstrating how I play, the technique I play. It's a chord guiding technique which does not involve reading music, mostly just knowing the chords, like you would know the chords on playing a, a guitar. You know, the C chord, C, A, G, F, C, F, A, C, and G chord, G, B, D. By knowing those uh, notes that make up a chord and uh, emphasizing on those chord notes, that guides your melody and you can, uh, and it also enforces your harmony as you play. Again, the so roses are red, violets are blue. Roses are red, violets are blue. 
Yeah, C chord, F chord, F chord, C, and C and G chord. Makes it easy to play, and uh, it amazes people. The people will think I play professionally as they, as they see and hear me play. So, as, as whenever possible, I'll be doing video showing how I what things songs I can play and my technique to play them so I can help you understand how how to follow along if you want to uh, learn how to play as well. Then, at last, any uh, travel plans I do this year will be uh, I'll be doing videos of them. I periodically I'll go up to Denver to visit my younger brother and his wife. Uh, we plan, I plan to go up there around uh, Memorial Day this year. There's no telling what we'll be doing yet. Yeah, probably uh, seeing a Rockies baseball game, maybe go to a concert, or any other events going on around Denver. So much to do there, of course, as big a city as it is. And uh, like last, last summer, I went to Hawaii. I did some videos on that that are available on my channel. And... And I thought the possibility of maybe going up to the uh, San Francisco Bay Area, where I used to live and work, to uh, revisit the area, you know, visit all, uh, visit the place where I used to live, see how things have changed, and hopefully uh, get back with some friends I have back there, maybe, you know, ski club friends that were part of the ski club I, uh, I was also a member in. And so that, if, I, if I do that, that would be, be a great experience, relive the life I used to live there in the Bay Area. So... That's what I have planned for this year, and uh, so just, just uh, keep on watching my channel and look forward to what I'm going to be doing. And th thanks for watching.